Welcome to part 4 of my Ultimate Mods Collection series, where I show you all the mods that I'm using in 2025 in City Skylines 1. This one's a tricky one, but let's go, we are covering an UI and camera tools. So camera movement mod makes slight changes on how camera moves, making it um, a lot smoother. Smoother, smooth. You can adjust the inertia point, which I sometimes lower to reduce camera, you know, jumpiness, jump scares. Chirpy Exterminator does exactly what the title suggests, it deletes Chirpy, which I find very annoying. The downside is that you will miss in-game information like it's about water, power or, or crime issues. Cinematic Camera Extended is a tool for recording cinematic camera movements. Unlike the building cinematic mode, which is very random, this mode gives you very precise control over recording. You choose you choose specific points between each camera moves, change speed and control whether the simulation runs during recording and so on. You can also save your projects, which is great for before and after shots. Resize it, it's a simple tool to change the size of scrollable panels, which is very helpful if you have a lot of assets and want to avoid excessive scrolling. Speed slider lets you modify the game speed and how fast the camera moves. While I'm not really sure how much it affects the simulation itself, it can help with lag or low FPS or just adjust the game to your liking. Undo it is a very simple but essential, I can believe still that we don't have this function in the vanilla game. It adds a Ctrl Z undo function. You can also adjust settings for refunds when undoing actions to mimic the vanilla options. And yeah, stay tuned for part 5 or check out the full video right now if you want to learn about all my 55 favorite mods.